Poland confirmed sending hundreds of tanks to Ukraine. Poland is buying almost 1,000 tanks and more than 600 pieces of artillery and also dozens of fighter jets from South Korea, in part to replace equipment donated to Ukraine to help Kyiv fight the Russian invasion, the Polish Ministry of Defense said. During a visit to Seoul in May, the Polish defense minister said the war in Ukraine showed Poland's urgent need for South Korean arms. We talked about accelerating the deliveries of these weapons to the Polish army. Why is it important? Because of the war on our eastern border. It's important for the Polish armed forces to be equipped with modern equipment, proven equipment, and such is the equipment produced by Korea. The agreement, expected to be officially announced in Poland on Wednesday, will see Warsaw purchase 980 tanks based on the South Korean K-2 model and 648 self-propelled K-9 or mod Howizers and 48 FA-50 and 48 FA-50 fighter jets, the ministry said. It wouldn't confirm the value of the deal. The first 180 K-2 tanks made by Hyundai Rotem and equipped with auto-loading 120mm guns are expected to arrive this year, with a production of 800 upgraded tanks starting in 2026 in Poland. The first 48 K-9 Howizers made by Hanhua Defense are also expected to arrive this year, with delivery of a second batch of 600 due to start in 2024. From 2025, these will be produced in Poland, according to the ministry. Chun in Boom, a retired South Korean general, said the deal with Poland is Seoul's single biggest weapons export pact ever. He also praised the weapons involved. The K-9 is probably the best artillery system in the world, rivaled only by the German system. The FA-50 is a combat version of the T-50, which has gained a reputation for being the best trainer in the world inventory. The K-2 tank in its latest version will be better than anything South Korea has to date, Chun said. This is BBS News. Thank you for listening. See you in the next videos.